What's going on guys? Um, in this video I will show you how to use the iPhone 4's FaceTime feature over AT&T's 3G network. As most of you guys know the FaceTime feature on the iPhone 4, the sort of video calling was only available over the Wi-Fi network um, but now since the iPhone 4 jailbreak has been released you can now use FaceTime over 3G. So in order to do this you're going to want to make sure that your iPhone 4 is jailbroken. Um, if you're not sure how to do that I'll put a link a um, little annotation up in the top corner there. Go ahead and click it. It'll lead you to a video on how to jailbreak your iPhone 4 and then come on back to this video. Um, and then once your iPhone 4 is all jailbroken, go ahead and open up Cydia and it will load its data here. And you're going to want to search for a package called My 3G. And there it is. And you just want to go ahead and install this. I already have it installed, so I won't um, do anything here. But just go ahead and install it, and um, it'll ask you to respring your springboard. And go ahead and do that, and it'll lead you back to the home screen. And you'll notice that a new app has been installed, My3G. Go ahead and open it up. Now, the first time you open this up, you're going to be asked to create sort of a username and password. Um, just go ahead and do this. And uh, once you have that all done, you should come to a page like this. And you're going to want to make sure that mobile phone has a little green check mark by it. That means that um, your mobile phone, FaceTime, will now work over 3G network. And you can also play around with the other settings um, to make sure that they, the settings that you want, the different apps, will work over 3G as well. So there you go. That is pretty much how you can use FaceTime over 3G, at least how you can enable it. I don't have a second iPhone 4 to test this out on, unfortunately, but uh, trust me, it does work. You can go search for a couple other videos if you'd like, uh, but just definitely wanted to let you guys know on how to enable it on your iPhone 4. If you have any questions, feel free to post a comment down below, um, and I will do my best to help you out. Also, if you do get this to work, and um, you film a video of you demonstrating it, go ahead and post it as a video response. That would be great, um, just to show that it does in fact work. And I will see you guys in the next video.